Good morning, dear all students. In this video, we are going to solve problems based on calculation of loop inductances. A single phase line has two parallel conductors 2 meters apart. The diameter of each conductor is 1.2 centimeters. Calculate the loop inductance per kilometer of the line. So here, first of all, you need to understand there are two conductors which are parallel and the distance between the two conductors is 2 meters apart. And the diameter they have mentioned is 1.2 centimeters. So first of all, we need to convert the diameter as well as the distance between the two conductors into centimeters first. So the same I did here. So the distance is 2 meters, that is 200 centimeters. And the radius of the conductor we have calculated that is 0 0.6 centimeters. We know that the loop inductance uh, per meter uh, uh, formula is 10 power minus 7, 1 plus 4 log to the base e d by r hindis per meter. So, here d is the distance between the two conductors and r is the radius of the conductor. So, now we can substitute the values of d and r in this equation. Like we can observe here 10 power minus 7 uh, into 1 plus 4 log to the base e 200 by 0 0.6 hindis. Now, by simplifying this one, we will get the value 24.23 into 10 to the power of minus 7 Henry's. Now, uh, loop inductance per kilometer length of the line they have asked. So, just know what we have calculated is per meter. Now, we are convert calculating per kilometer. So, multiply the value into 1000. We will get by simplification of this one into 2.423 milli Henry's. Generally, the inductance will be um, mentioned in milli Henry's. Next, we will solve one more problem on the same concept. Uh, here, a single phase transmission line has two parallel conductors 2 meters apart. The radius of each conductor being 1 centimeter. Calculate the loop inductance per kilometer length of the line if the material of the conductor is copper and steel with a re relative permeability of 100. So, you can see in this problem compared with the previous problem, uh, there are uh, two different materials that they have given in this problem. We need to calculate the loop inductance. First, we will go with the uh, copper conductor where the relative permeability is 1. So, again uh, I will mention here the spacing between the conductors is uh, 300 centimeters and the radius of each conductor is r equal to 1 centimeter. Uh, already we know that the loop inductance formula as 10 power minus 7 into uh, mu r plus 4 log to the base c d by r hendis per meter. Now, first we will go with the first problem uh, that is with copper conductors where the relative permeability mu r is 1. So, substitute the same here 10 power minus 7 1 plus 4 into log to the base e d by r in this per meters. Here d is 300 and r is uh, 1 centimeter. So, uh, after substituting and simplifying this one, we will get a value 23.8 into 10 to the power of minus 7 Hendis per meter. But we have to calculate uh, um, per kilometer length. So, uh, multiply the value with 1000, we will get 2.38 into 10 to the power of minus 3 milli Hendis. Now, we will go with the second one. Uh, with the steel conductors where mu r equal to 100. So, again substitute the uh, uh, value in place of mu r earlier we have substituted 1 but now it is 100. Why? Because steel conductors the permeability is 100. So, loop inductance per meter first we are calculating that is 10 power minus 7 into 100 plus 4 log to the base C 300 by 1 and this per meter. So, by simplifying this one we will get 122.8 into 10 to the power of minus 7 and this. But we want in kilometers the loop inductance. So, the loop inductance per kilometer is equal to 122.8 into 10 to the power of minus 7 into 1000. So, by simplifying this one, we will get 12.28 milli Hendis. I hope you understood uh, these two problems. Thank you. Thank you, Ananda.